previously on The Walking Dead. I know who you are. Oh, I got oh, another shit. good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> God. And I don't give a shit about Poor dogs to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, it's definitely a recap of everything guys. I did, all my choices, which is actually pretty damn cool. It's a continuation. See? Read that. It's tailored to the way you play, so obviously my playthrough is going to be perfect. Telltale Games presents in association with Skybound Entertainment Shenmue 36 starring three months later in your dad motherfucker yeah bitch the walking dead Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but... I'd take it. Rabbit is delicious. No, I have no, no idea. Kidding. I never ate a rabbit. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Um, We'll manage. We'll manage. Maybe. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. Lily knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food... How come you get the gun and I got an axe? Things are getting I know I'm a badass and all, but I would like to have a sniper you know, rifle. Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry? The old guy's a on dick, and I want to kill him. What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Yeah, he's a fucking Sounds asshole. Sounds like he's got a problem with you in particular. <sighs> he's just an old racist asshole. That's his deal. Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Our problems are not. We should all be out here trying to find food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all <laughs> muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I do. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Yeah, he's a fucking Knock asshole. Knock me flat. Hit me with a sucker punch. Toe to toe. I'll fuck him up, though. You're gonna miss, aren't you? Don't. Gunshot will bring walkers. One bird's not worth it. Yeah, I know. I'm just really freaking hungry. Shit! Ah! Kenny! Kenny! I don't know. Come on! We're coming, Kenny! Where are you at, buddy? 
Give me the gun. I need the gun. You're not gonna be able to hit anything. That's why I didn't let you shoot the bird. Oh no. This dude's in trouble. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Damn, everybody please. has got it's a okay. goddamn gun but me. Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. We've gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Was he bit? Oh, uh, you better not be lying, no, sunshine. Hurry, please, hurry. This trap has been altered. How are you step in a bear trap in the center of the woods that you was in the Oh shit. Oh shit! Give me the gun! It's now or never Lee. Please! Get me out of this! Mark, get the boys back! Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! I'm gonna cut your leg off! No, no, no! Dude, I gotta Try cut to your leg me. off. Trust me, I'm a doctor! Try to cut the chain! Call that! I'm doing this for your own good, son. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry, I'm a surgeon. You get surgical on this shit! Oh, that's great. That's great. You're free! See? Wake up. Uh, oh God. Is he, is he, he passed out. out of the trap. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. You. Travis! Come on, Travis, come on. you better run, buddy. Oh, Travis. Oh, Travis. No! The Walking Dead. Episode 2, Starved for Hell. Climbing time! Uh, there's Doc. It's open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! Oh my god! 
What happened? Oh, what is that? What's going on? We have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, I may have cut that guy's leg Lee. off. What? I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died you if you are an asshole. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You, know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Tell her, Kenny. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. Oh, for Christ's sake. Er I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Why don't you go eat the business end of a shotgun, you old fuck? Scumbag. You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. I'll do it. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Okay, well, old fuck doesn't get food, and neither do you. You have four food items for ten hungry people. Sweet. That sucks. That sucks. How am I gonna... Ah, shit! Alright, maybe it is a hard job. 